for clicking on my channel thank you. I told you guys in my other video that like every youtuber has like this intro that they say when they start the video I don't have anything like that I don't even know what I would say if I had an intro like welcome back to my channel thank you for clicking on the video it's MJ Byar I travel hit subscribe and like the video <laughs> comment below yeah I don't know um, but anyways, welcome back to my channel. You guys love when I just talk, so that's what I'm gonna do. There's been so much going on, like I said in my other videos. So, 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 so much going on in my videos. And I had to take a little break, but I feel like I am back in my momentum. If you guys follow me on Instagram, which you should if you don't, um, then you may have heard about on my stories how I almost freaking died. Kidding, I almost, I didn't almost die, but... I haven't been able to fall asleep in the last, I hadn't been able to fall asleep in the last like two weeks and I know like a lot of people who work for themselves say that they struggle with this issue because your mind is always rolling because like you're your own boss right so you have to be your own accountability everything so a lot of people like that we don't know how to turn it off and I literally couldn't fall asleep I was like in bed trying everything and then somebody recommended me a shiatsu massage and I got this shiatsu massage I got this shiatsu massage and immediately I came back and I fell asleep and I've been sleeping like 11 hours every day ever since it's insane um, I feel way better than I had because um, I was like go 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 going constantly um, and it's so crazy because um, it's so funny walking around now in all the stores everybody knows me like <laughs> uh, the other day I got a text from Prada and um, they were like we just got a new shipment in and then Burberry is always texting me like come look I got invited to a showroom at Prada as well and a showroom at Dior um, even Sephora where I went today they texted me and they were like uh, MJ, we just got the inky list. We know how much because I had told them before that like I love the inky list. It's one of my favorite skincare uh, companies, but they don't carry it in Dubai. They only carry it in the Sephora in the U.S. So I was super bummed out about that. And they texted me today and they're like, "We just got a new shipment in. We're carrying the inky list. We're also now carrying Fenty Skin. If you want to check it out." And I was like, "Oh my gosh!" So. I'll show you what I got from Prada the other day. So they text me because this, I had been into Prada before and I was looking for this bag. <sighs> She's so beautiful. How gorgeous is she? I'm like super protective because I don't want to get anything on this bag. But um, this is the Prada 2000s re-edition nylon mini bag. It is so beautiful. And I have been looking for this specific pink one for ever and it was literally sold everywhere if you go on the Prada website it's sold out everywhere and they just got a new shipment in at the Dubai mall 
and they call me and they're like, we have the pink one. We don't know how long it's going to be here. You better come in. And I ran and got it. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. The girl at Prada. She follows me on Instagram. She watches my videos. Thank you so much. What's her name? Uh, no, no, no. Her name is... Uh, she's beautiful Russian woman. Uh, Nika. Aww. She's so sweet. She sold me the bag. And she, she's the one who hit me up, so... Thank you so much to her. She's adorbs. Russian girl. Thank you, Nika. This is your shout out for hooking me up with this bag. Anyways, and then um, I got a text, like I said, from Sephora. And they were like, look, we got the inky list now. So I went into, I went a little ham. But I haven't been able to have access to it because they didn't sell it in the in the uh, in UAE until just now. So I went ham. I literally got you guys know how much I love hyaluronic acid. I got one, two. I left one because I felt bad because I'm like, I know somebody else might want some hyaluronic acid. <laughs> so I got three of them hyaluronic acids from the Inky List. I also got some niacinamide. I love niacinamide. Also, I got my favorite, ooh, favorite PHA toner from the Inky List. You guys, I love the Inky List. And I also got the salicylic acid cleanser, which I've never used, but I hear so many good things about this cleanser. Um, I feel like every time I go to the mall now, I'm going to be stocking up because the Inky List is really, 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 really affordable. And this stuff works amazing. Like, I think the hyaluronic acid in this jar is seven dollars in the u.s it was 35 dirham here and see it's like this little bottle so but like a little goes a long way i just use it every single morning every single night hyaluronic acid is my life okay and then i got this uh i just no i'm pissed i knew this was gonna happen i got shampoo I don't use shampoo. I meant to get the conditioner. That's what you get, MJ. I don't use shampoo. Anyways, and then I can't show you the other stuff I got because it's for my girls that are going to be here next week. For my first leg of my Dubai trip, I'm giving everyone goodie bags. So the rest of the stuff in here is for the girls. Um, I'm still building the goodie bags for them when they get here. So anyways, yeah, a lot of you guys are asking that, a lot of you guys are asking like, how is it so easy for you to like move somewhere, or, like live somewhere, like I'm here in Dubai and I'm living like a local and I tend to do that everywhere I go in a way or whatever. And to be honest, I would say, and my Instagram, on Instagram I was talking about how I really know how to make myself at home anywhere, and uh, if you guys have been following me for a long time, I consider myself living. So like I always say, oh I'm moving here, I'm moving there, I'm moving here, I'm moving there. But it's like, in my head, I am moving to that place because I don't have a home. I don't have an apartment at the moment. I don't own, I don't pay rent. I don't have a mortgage. I live where my suitcase is where my suitcase is which is where i am is where i'm living so i'm living in dubai otherwise where would i be living where do i live if i don't if i'm not living here i'm a nomad so wherever my hat is is my home so yeah anyways i am on a tourist visa right now i got one just a couple weeks ago for here in dubai and to me, I'm living here. I don't know what you would consider it traveling, but it's not really traveling because I have no home. I live on the road. I live as a travel blogger. So anyways, um, I feel like I try to, when I travel somewhere, live semi like a local. I will try and find locals. I will try and connect with them. 
and I just kind of study the way of life where I am and I try and when in Rome right do what the Romans do so when I'm here in Dubai it, it was really easy for me to just kind of make myself at home here because one this is a city of foreigners right I always do this in places where it's like a big hub of foreigners so like Paris when I live there Paris is like anyone can live in Paris Paris is a city of Paris is a beautiful blend of so many different cultures and so is Dubai, so is Tokyo, all the places I've lived, so is Shanghai. So like, it's really easy for me to integrate myself into their livelihood. I figure out how much it costs to stay afloat in places that, that I choose to be, that I choose to live. Um, I couldn't do Mexico. <laughs> when I was, I was in Mexico right before Dubai. And I couldn't do it. Like, I couldn't do it. I was like, eh. nothing against Mexico. Beautiful country, sweetest people, delicious food. But I could not stay there longer than 30 days. Um, I need, I'm a sit. I hate to say city girl. Because when you say you're a city girl, people think, oh, you're talking about the rappers? No, that's not what I mean. I'm talking about, I'm a city girl, as in, I love a city. I love cities they're my thing <laughs> they're my favorite places to travel i do like to switch it up and go to like the jungle or like you know more you know different type of places uh, of course that's what traveling is it's going to different environments but as far as me living i can only really live in cities i, I only like cities and it's super easy to just live as if you were living anywhere else yeah. Anyways, I am so upset that I got shampoo because I meant to get the condition. Desert. No one really ever sees it, but there's leopards in these mountains, which I think is just so freaking cool. He's on the other side, I have to walk to him. And he said that there's leopards in the mountains. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. I seen one, but it was too far away to get a picture. It was like fiery red and orange. Wow. And there's caves in here and they say inside the caves there's leopards. Yeah, but no one ever sees. Huh? What? So, guys, look at this beautiful greenhouse. So nice, so nice. I like. Yes, pomegranate. Yeah, just. More something. Uh, Maybe. Um, I've taken so many buses through Egypt mm -hmm. and it's just this for hours. <laughs> tunnels, mountains, tunnels, mountains, all over Egypt. Beautiful though. Where are we? <laughs> what is this? A castle? No. Mm. It's like a fort. What? Wow. Farms. It's a little hotter out here. <laughs> Heat. 
this is the corner. Still under construction, not yet finished. Uh, like they're rebuilding. recording video. <laughs> a video? Yeah. yeah. It's already going. Yes. Yes. Very nice. It's very nice. Look at one. It's hot out here. Ooh. Can I say uh, farm you say? Farms, yeah. Farms, do you know? Yes. It's like uh, uh, vegetables. Okay. But not now not. Uh, they're just getting ready for that. Okay. And uh, Palm trees, the day is growing on palm trees. Yeah. And there is. Wow. Where does the water come from? They will bring it, everything. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. You can see the banana. That's oh, a banana. Yeah. The trees, it's yeah. banana. Wow. So cool. Thank you. <sighs> I don't like hiking with a mask. Okay. Yeah, okay. Let me take a breather. Old oh, what? Old Quran. Oh. Quran. Quran is the holy book. I know the Quran, yeah. Quick, like Shadja Shuk. Peacock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just like I also believe before that, if you keep the peacock in peacock's uh, beds, this one, and it will be delivered and you baby. Oh, baby, <laughs> will, you did that? Oh. <laughs> in childhood, childhood memories. Uh -huh. This one? Mm-hmm. This is the new one. This is current, no. Yeah. Not current one. No, no, no. no. This one also old. Now it's changing. Yeah. Similar. Similar, yeah. Design is changes. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I have that dollar. I have all these dollars. You know, I have a collection as of my own. Mm -hmm. I take a dollar from each country. I have a collection. You have a collection? Yeah. Every country. 104. Like 104 collection, like countries collection you have? Yes, I have most of these dollars in here. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I take like one dollar. For yeah. each country, I keep it. Yes, one dollar. Until I, dinner. until I have a dollar from every country you in the have world. Indian rupee? I do. Yeah. A lot, actually, because <laughs> I, I had a lot left over, yeah. and I couldn't exchange it. Yes. 